Hey guys, it's Chef Bo, and this week we're doing a classic fountain drink and adding our Friday spin on it. It's deep fried cherry Coke. Let's go. So the first step, we're gonna take our cherry cola, get our saute pan uh, to a low, medium heat, and we're gonna add about a cup and a half. We're gonna let it reduce half the quantity so we can get a nice like syrupy consistency. We're gonna hop on and make our whipped cream, which take your heavy whipping cream, a little bit of sugar, a pinch of salt just to highlight the flavor. So it pairs really well with the Coca-Cola. We're gonna use a little bit of bourbon. Now we're gonna whisk away until we get some soft peaks or into that thick consistency that we're looking for. So we've got our whipped cream to the consistency. We have the nice soft peaks from whisking it. Now what I'm looking to achieve is that classic fountain drink, the old soda pop flavor. So I'm gonna add a little bit of a cocoa powder just to make it that chocolatey, sort of old Coke soda fountain taste. Now put it at the end. I don't wanna mix it up too much because I really like the way that it swirls in there. Now we're gonna move it to the refrigerator and let it chill out for a bit. All right, so we're gonna move on to the deep fried cherry cola batter. So what we're gonna do is take eggs, don't beat it too much. You don't want to overwork that egg. We're going to add the sugar, the star of the show, the cherry cola. Just get them nice incorporated. So we have our flour, a little bit of baking powder, and a pinch of salt to highlight that flavor. So the reason why we sift, it helps incorporate air into the dry ingredients, which ultimately is going to create a fluffier donut hole. And hey, it's not cooking unless you make a mess. All right. We're gonna combine it to our liquid, slowly at a time, just so we don't rush it. So growing up, me and my family, we'd always eat at this particular diner. And it was like a 50s throwback diner. And I remember getting cherry Coke for the very first time. And I just loved how bold of a flavor it was. And I also liked on the menu too, not only that cherry Coke, they had chocolate Coke, they had all kinds of different flavored Coca-Colas. So I was really excited to do this one because I wanted to bring back that taste of my childhood and incorporate it onto the show Friday. All right. So I think we're there, guys. You know what time it is, right? It's time to fry, baby. You can use an ice cream scoop. Uh, you could use a spoon. I like to use a spoon because I like to make nice, funky shapes out of these. I like to start at 12 o'clock and then rotate around just so I know which one's dropped first. So these are gonna fry for about three to five minutes. You wanna get a nice golden brown crust on there. And then what you could do is you play a game. You name that shape, just like you do with clouds. Oh, I see a unicorn in here. I see a, I see a goose. All right, we're gonna take our fun little guys on out of here. The star of the show, the deep fried cherry Coke is all ready. We're gonna move this over to plating and start eating. So we're just gonna take our little dough balls Pile them up all nice and stack them up. Add some elevation and some height. We've got our Coke syrup that we're gonna put in here. And this way we can use it as a nice little dipping sauce to put in. Cocoa whipped cream with a touch of bourbon. Just kind of dance this all around. I'm adding just a little bit of cocoa powder on top. A maraschino cherry. Deep fried cherry Coke. Delicious dessert, a childhood memory on a plate. Thanks for joining us, and make sure to catch us on the next episode. It's Friday.